Hello everyone, welcome to my review of the 483 day war between Russia and Ukraine. Uh, first, I will say uh, the important breaking news and then uh, and then we go deeper into the map of where where the war is going. I wish this war would end in Ukraine's favor. Ukraine will win. Russia will collapse. Putin and all the dictators will go to jail. So watch the video to the end and be with me. President Volodymyr Zelensky said Ukraine's forces were destroying Russian forces in two main areas of the conflict in the east and south Ukraine. Please look in the map. Yes. Uh, war going in um, east and south uh, areas regions of Ukraine. Russia launched a major drone assault on Kyiv and other cities. Ukrainian officials said uh, with air defense systems shooting down 28 out of 30 Iranian-made shaded drones. And Russian appointed authorities in the occupied town of Nova Kahovka said one woman was killed and four injured in, in a Ukrainian drone attack. Ukraine's defense minister said the European Union will train 30,000 soldiers this year as part of the EU military assistance mission for Ukraine. Russia's Defense Minister Sergei Shoigu claimed Ukraine planned to strike Crimea with long-range HIMARS artillery and storm shadow missiles and warned that Moscow would retaliate if that happened. Russia annexed Ukraine's Crimean Peninsula in 2014. Russia is defense minister said it awarded 1 million Russian rubles to a soldier who destroyed a German Leopard tank in Ukraine. Denmark, Denmark is defense minister announced an additional aid package for Ukraine wars. 21.9 billion kroner to include weapons, other military equipment, emergency equi equipment, and training. And now we go to now we go deeper into the map where is the active fighting is going on. As I said, the fighting in Ukraine is taking place in the south and east region. As you can see, Russia is actively shelling the territory of Ukraine. Yes, please look in the map. Yes, Russia is actively shelling the territory Ukraine of Ukraine. It is 480 Thursday. No first day, no second day. War is going, yeah. war is going long. Yes. Please, please look the look look the map. Yes, Rus Russia shelling actively shelling the territory of Ukraine. Uh, first of yes, it is this is at Zaporozhye area, Zaporozhye and Kherson area. At Zaporozhye and Kherson directions, Russian army shell at Niskushny. Makarivka, Storozhivy, Chervoni, Levaden, please, uh, here, Levaden, Hulepoli, Zarishni, Charivni, Biozirka, 
yes actively shelling bombs it's this is picture means bomb maladurni nadinki yes it is sadovi pridniprovsky ivanivka this is Herson and the Zaporozhye directions. The Zaporozhye, please look in this. Yes, Zaporozhye and Herson di directions. Uh, here, going to defense forces of Ukraine continue to conduct an offensive operation in the Melatopol and Berdyansk directions at Novodanivka, Robotid, Malatokmachka. Virbovi, Vine Paul, Makarivka. They are also restraining the advance of Russian troops in the Liman and Bakhmut directions. Heavy fighting co continues at the Liman direction in the areas of Yampalivka and Serebryansky forestry. Offensive actions were carried out in the direction Bilharivka. Shipilivka. Mm, please look Donetsk, Donetsk and Luhansk. At Marienka direction, Russian army shelled Krasnohorivka, Hurivka, Marianka, and Pabeda of Donetsk region. Russian aviation conducted airstrikes at Marianka. General Staff of Armed Forces of Ukraine says in the morning report uh, here going operation at Siversina and uh, Slobozhanshina. Directions Russian Army Shalot Halahanivka, Karpovich of Chernih region, Stepen and then Russian Aviation conducted airstrikes at Yanjulivka and Leonivka of Chernif region. Yes, operation is going in east and south of territory Ukraine. And then today, uh, overnight, six shade Iranian drones will shoot down overnight in Ukrainian territory. And uh, blackouts in several districts in Kyiv due in malfunction of power grid. Security service of Ukraine detained and FSB again who has preparing new attacks by the Russian Federation on, on electric substations in five regions of Ukraine. Uh, the railway was damaged by an explosion near Fyodosia. In the occupied Crimea, the occupation authorities authorities promised to restore traffic into ours so in conclusion such events are taking place in the Ukra in the territory of ukraine i hope this video was informative uh, please subscribe to the channel and not don't miss out my future reviews glory to ukraine